Now we ask you bow us in prayer, meditate as the elder chamber shall lead us in prayer. Right, just an everlasting Father. We are thanking you one more time, Lord God, for another day that you have added to the human family. Lord Jesus, we give you thanks for your precious and loving kindness towards all the people of God everywhere, Lord God, especially those that are fasting, offering up their bodies as a living sacrifice, Lord Jesus. We are thanking you, Lord God, for our Pastor Bishop Belton Green. Lord God, ever keep him, ever console him, hold him up, Lord Jesus, in these last and evil days. We are praying for his assistant, Bishop Melvin Samuels, Lord God, as he stands in his stead, Lord God, even to preach the old truth and nothing but the truth. We are thanking you, Lord Jesus, for this gospel that you yourself brought down from heaven. Father, you died upon the cross that we might live eternally. We are praying for your blessing, Lord Jesus, upon those that are cast down, those that are oppressed of the devil. Father, we are praying for those in the nursing home, those in the hospital. Lord Jesus, we are praying for those in darkness. Send out your word, Lord Jesus. Heal and deliver, Lord Jesus. Remember those, Lord Jesus. Oh, God, you are getting weak. Give strength unto your people. Help the people to serve you and to love you. We are praying for the rulers of the land. Help them to rule well, Lord Jesus, that we live a peaceable and quiet life. Lord Jesus, we are praying for the choir as they sing the songs of Zion, that somebody's heart will be refreshed. Somebody will become comforted, Lord Jesus. Send out your word, Lord Jesus. Oh, God, we pray that when you come back, for your glorious church, we too shall be found worthy to be in that number to help crown your Lord of Lords, King of Kings. We pray and ask in the precious name of Jesus Christ, even for the glory of God. In Jesus' name we ask and pray. Amen. Friends and neighbor, you're tuned to the Bible True God's Radio Service coming to you from the Holy Temple Church of the Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostolic Faith. Bishop Belton Green invites you to visit here at our headquarters temple. Located at 2075 Clinton Avenue, Bronx, New York City. Service Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, 7.30 p.m. Sunday, noonday. Now, in case you're interested in reading some biblical literature, the mailing address is Bishop Belton Green, P.O. Box 523, Bronx, New York, zip code 10457. It will be sent to you free of charge. Dear listeners, you're invited to visit the Holy Temple Church located at the headquarters in New York City. 2075 Clinton Avenue, Bronx, New York. Bishop Green, Apostle, Pastor, and General Overseer. Bishop Melvin Samuel, Assistant. Washington, D.C., 2635 Martin Luther King, Jr. Avenue. Bishop Melvin Samuel, Pastor, Minister Thomas Norwood, Assistant. Norfolk, Virginia, 800 Elk Street, on the corner, Capitol Cell and Elk Street. Elder Lee Taylor, Pastor. Petersburg, Virginia, 23 South Jefferson Street. Elder Douglas Robinson, Pastor, Minister Mark Woodlock, Assistant. Gloucester, Virginia, Route 17, near the White Marsh Shopping Center. Elder Robert William, in charge, Minister Ernest Page, Assistant. Evergreen, North Carolina, 10362 Old Lumberton Road, near the Lenin Crossroad, Elder Samuel Wilder, Pastor. Wilson, North Carolina, 48th North Penn Street. Bishop Green, Pastor, Minister Pierre Gershom, Assistant. Columbia, South Carolina, 5800 North Main Street. Bishop Melvin Samuel, Pastor Bishop Randy Mack, Assistant. Yamasee, South Carolina, number two, Wall Street, on the Highway 17, in the Yamasee Business District. Bishop Willie Beach, Pastor Greenville, South Carolina, 903 West Washington Street. Bishop Curtis Ford, Pastor. Monts Corner, South Carolina, 398 Corner Square, North U.S. Highway 52. Elder Elsa McMillan, Pastor. Memphis, Tennessee, 3196 Ford Road. Bishop Samuel Wilkes, Pastor. Jacksonville, Florida, 702 Lafayette Street on the corner, Albert and Lafayette. Elder Philip Boston, Pastor, Minister Henry Floyd, now Assistant. Camden, Florida, 2385 Contour Drive. Bishop Green, Pastor, Academic and Charles Jones in charge. Toronto, Canada, 475 Eddystone Avenue, Unit 23. Located near Jane Flinch, Elder Carl Newell, Pastor. Now at this time, it is my pleasure to present unto you from the Holy Temple Church of the Lord Jesus Christ, the next voice you hear, the assistant pastor, Bishop Melvin Samuel. You can make me doubt him. You can make me doubt him. You can make me doubt him in my heart. 
You can make me doubt him. You can make me doubt him. You can make me doubt him. In my heart. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. In my heart. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. In my heart. God, the love of Jesus. God, the love of Jesus. God, the love of Jesus in my heart. Oh, I've got the love of Jesus. God, the love of Jesus. God, the love of Jesus in my heart. Satisfy with Jesus. Satisfy with Jesus. Satisfy with Jesus in my heart. Satisfy with Jesus. Satisfy with Jesus. Satisfy with Jesus in my heart. You can make me doubt it. You can make me doubt it. You can make me doubt him. Oh, you can make me doubt him. You can make me doubt him. You can make me doubt him in my heart. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. Let the church say, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise our God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Let the church say, praise the Lord again. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 You can't make me doubt it. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Amen. My God. Some say you can't make me doubt it. My God, that's a true song. I love that song. Praise God. Because that's a true song. My God, I believe it. That when a man or a woman don't believe this gospel right. and don't set the, the seal mm -hmm. that God's word is true, Amen. no power on earth, my God, no power on earth, Amen. gonna cause you to make them doubt God. Amen. You know, they beat the apostles. Yes. They try to beat it out of them. Yes. My God, but after all the beating, my God. God, they're still going to make the doubt. Hey. My God, they stoned them. They drew him out the city for dead. Yes. But Apostle Paul said, none of these things move me. Praise God. You know, I feel like giving God a hand clap. 
my God. I feel like Hallelujah. praising God. Yes. I feel like praising Hallelujah. God. Praise Somebody say, as good as God has been to us, yes. we just can't afford not to praise his name. Amen. My God, I'm saying it's a blessing when you receive this testimony yes. and set to your seal, God's word is true. You're going to be a tough one against the enemy. So we want to give God thanks. We want to praise God. We want to thank God from the depths of our heart. We want the Lord to know how much we thank him, how much we appreciate him, because realize he didn't have to do it, but he did. Oh, yes. Somebody say he gave us a believing heart. And I'm thanking God for blessing us, calling us out of darkness yeah. into this great and marvelous light. We do thank God and honor, uh, honor our very own beloved Bishop and Apostle, none other than our beloved Bishop Belton Green. Amen. Thank God for him. Thank God for his labor, his great sacrifice he has put forth. Down through the years, I'm thanking God for him allowing me this opportunity to come before you all in Raider Land and all the saints of the Most High God filling in his head once more. Yeah. I'm thanking God for the truth of the gospel. Thank God for the truth of the gospel. Amen. is going to stand forever. Yes. My Amen. God, I'm a firm believer that no power on earth Gonna be able to come along and change the purpose of God. He purposed it. I was thinking about it so strong. He purposed and ordained it. Yeah. Before man ever walked the face of the earth, that he's gonna have a holy people yeah. and to himself. My God and the purpose of God gonna stand forever. Amen. You better get me Titus. Uh, Titus yeah. chapter one. And verse 1, yeah. in hope yes. of eternal life. Which Amen. God cannot lie. My God, do you hear what the word of God said? He cannot lie. So far it was impossible mm -hmm. for God to lie. Which God that cannot lie. Yes, promise My before the God, world. God, what he promised, he's going to stand by his word. My God. God, a pastor Paul said, for it was impossible yes. for God to lie. My God, what God promised in hope yes. of eternal life. Which God that cannot lie. Which God that cannot lie. Promised before the world. My God began. says, you can take God at his word. Oh. My word. God, what he said, it, he going to do it. Yeah. You can rest assured. You're going to take, take him at his word. Amen. Which God. Yes, they he, cannot lie. He's not, he's not like a man. No. Man will say something and they change it. Well, One man put it in and the next man come behind and change it. Right. My Amen. God, but what God set up. My Amen. God, he said what I say to one, I say to all. He prepare it before the face of all people. Yes, and he ain't going to change it for God no one. Bless your heart, Bishop. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's what I love about God. He's going to stand by his word yes. in hope of eternal life. With God that cannot With lie. God that cannot lie. Promise before the he world begins. Promise yeah. by God before men walk the face of the earth. You think he's going to promise and set it up? And let some man come behind and change it. My God, he asked, he asked Job, say, will thou disannow my judgment mm -hmm. to make yourself right? Mm -hmm. My God, he ain't going to let no man come and change his purpose. That's right. He said, be holy for I am holy. And that's what it's going to take. Which God that cannot lie. That cannot lie. Promise before the world began. Promise. Before the world began, has in due time, have in due time, manifest his word through preaching. Manifest his word through preaching. My God, say, how shall you hear without a preacher? 
how shall they preach except they be sent? Amen. Nobody going to have no excuse. No, Manifest that. That's why Job, Job had to, uh, I mean, Balaam, after all the reward and the divination, everything, Balaam offered him to come curse God people. God say, these are my people. Yeah. My God, thou shalt not curse. My God, finally, after all, all that Balaam did, he had to come on back in Numbers chapter 23. And he had to acknowledge it. He had to straighten out Balaam. Listen to me, Balaam. Yeah. My God, you want me to curse these people. How these people are blessed people. These people are That's blessed. Sure. You calling me to come curse these people. You better start from the 23rd chapter and verse 5. Run it on down there. Yeah. And the Lord the, the put Lord. a word in Balaam's mouth. My God, you know, that's how. That's what I love about God. God speak at once in a dream, in a vision of the night. Yeah. When man can purpose to do one thing, but God can come to you in a dream and change your purpose while you're sleeping. You wake up. And say, I want, I want to serve God. Listen what the word of God said. And the Lord put a word in Balaam's mouth. Put a and word said, and said. And said, return unto Balaam. Go on back to Balaam. Thus thou, thou shalt speak. Read on. And he returned unto him. And lo. And lo. He stood by the burnt sacrifice. Yes. He and all the prince of Moab. Read on. And he took up his parable and Ye said. Yes. Balak, the king of Moab. Moab. Mm -hmm. Yes, has brought me from Aram. My God, I don't care who you bring. They're not going to change the purpose of God. Read on. Out of Aram, the Mount of East, saying, saying, Come curse me, Jacob. Come curse me, Jacob. And come defile Israel. Come defile Israel. How shall I curse whom God My has not cursed? God. That's why it's there. It's to trust in the Lord and to put confidence. Trust God. That's it, Bishop. Amen. Listen what Balaam said. How shall I curse whom God has not cursed? How shall I curse whom God has not cursed? My God, when God bless a man or a woman, he can bless a group of people and nobody can curse them. My God, every time Balaam tried to curse them, he turned it into a blessing. Yes. My God, read on what it said. How shall I curse? How shall I curse? Who, uh, how shall I curse whom God has not cursed? Whom God have not cursed? How shall I defile whom God has not defiled? How shall I defile whom God have not defiled? So from the top of the rocks I see My him. God, I see them from the top of the rocks. And from the hills I behold, I behold him. I behold him. And lo, 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 the people shall dwell alone. My God, God got a special people. Yeah. My God, we are dwelling at home. Yeah. Hallelujah. We won't link up with nothing else. I see why Jew began to write that you should earnestly contend for the faith. Lo, people should dwell my alone. My God, that's why I love God, people. My God, my God. I see why Ruth telling your people gonna be my people. Your God gonna be my God. Where you go, I'm going. Where you die, I'm going to die. You know, it's a blessing to have a steadfast mind to be with the people of God. You know, I want to be with God people. I enjoy being with God people. I don't want to be with nobody else but the people of God. Lord! Yes, how shall I depart? Yes. Whom God, whom the Lord has not defiled. Read on. From the top of the rocks I see him. Read on. And from the hill I behold him. I behold him. Lo. Lo. The people should dwell alone. My God says we are standing alone. Yes. We are standing alone. Amen. Hallelujah. The, the should word of alone. God said a righteous also. Gonna hold on to his way. They that have clean hand were waxing stronger and stronger. People to criticize and mock. What's the matter? They thought they're the only one. They won't link up with nobody else. No. 
My God, we are standing alone. Do you hear what the word of God said? No. Do not link up with nothing else. Yes. Hallelujah. We are standing alone. My God, we believe and we are sure. If you, my God, he says, boss says, not another. But there be some that trouble you. Lord. If you shall dwell alone. Stand alone. If you are alone by yourself, stand alone. I'm standing alone. Every child of God gonna stand alone. My God, you won't link up with nothing else. We have saints all out west and other places. They're standing alone. My God, they won't link up with nothing else until they get with their own company. My God, I won't link up with nothing else. I don't turn on nothing else. My God, I stay with my own company. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If there come any unto you and don't bring this gospel. I don't receive them in my house. I don't bid them God's speed. Why? Because we are dwelling alone. Lord, the people should I dwell want alone. the world to know we are standing alone. We are standing flat footed. My God, do you hear what the word of God said? The people shall dwell the alone. People shall dwell alone. And shall not be reckoned who among the nations. Not be reckoned among the nations. Who can count the dust of Jacob? Who can count the dust of Jacob? Or the number of poor part of Israel. Read on. Let me die the death oh, of the righteous. Hallelujah. That's what I want to be. I want to go down with God, people. I don't want to mix up out there. My God with the rest. I want to be with God, people. Yes. Let me die. The death of the righteous. The death of the righteous. And let my last end be like him. Oh, what a blessing. I want my last end to be like God, people. Yes. I want my last end to be like them. Why? Hallelujah. Blessed are the day with dying the Lord. For yea, henceforth said the spirit. They have what? Rest from their labor. And the work's going to follow them. Yeah. I want to go down like a child of God. I don't want to go down in and believe. I want to go down believe in God. Hallelujah. Hey, do you hear what the word of God said? I want to go down. Believe in God. Amen. God, and Balak said unto Balaam. Tell unto Balaam. What hast thou done unto me? What have you done unto me? I should be to curse my enemy. I want you to curse my enemy. And behold, thou hast blessed them all together. You see, every time God got it all in control. Oh, yes. Every time they opened the mouth to curse, God turned it into a blessing. And yet, man can't do no more. Than God allow him to do. I got law. I want you to curse them. Yes. But every time you open your mouth, you bless them. Read on. Yes, and Balak tell Balaam. Read on. What has I done unto me? Read on. I took thee to curse my enemy. I want you to curse them. And behold, behold, God has blessed them all together. You have blessed them all and together. And he said. Read on. Must I not take heed to speak? Hallelujah. Saints, I want you all to know a man can't do no more than God allow him to do. Man. Because God is stronger than man. God is greater than man. No man can do no more than God allow him to do. Hallelujah. Why? Because he got it all in control. You better get me Job in the book of Job chapter 33 and verse 12. Man can do no more, hallelujah, than God allow him to do. My God, my God, God is the boss. He is the boss. Oh, yes, he is the boss. Amen. Read on. Job 33 and verse 12. Yes, sir. Be holding this, thou uh, not just. Thou art not just. I will answer thee. I'm going to answer thee. That God is greater than man. Who is greater? God. God. He's greater than man. Hallelujah. The God that we serve. He is greater than man. He is greater than man. Yes. But because he is greater than man. Oh, Balaam couldn't do no more than God allow him to do. They get me Jeremiah now. Jeremiah chapter 10 verse 23. Yes. My God, my God. It's not in man that walketh. High God to direct his step. 
God can direct your step. Man, look what he did to Paul. Paul going with a letter to, to persecute, bound, bring back God people. But God knocked him down. What a mighty God we serve. Get me Jeremiah 10, 23 now. What is it? In the book of Jeremiah chapter 10 and the 23rd verse of the yeah. year. What Man. is it? Oh Lord. Oh Lord. I know. What? I know. It's a blessing when you know this. Everybody don't know this. No, sir. If they know it, they would have humble themselves. Right. Everybody don't know it. But my God, it's a blessing when you're understanding yeah. open. Right. Oh Lord, I know that the ways of man is Hallelujah. not in himself. My God, do you hear what he said? It's not up to you, sir. It's not up to you, miss. Hallelujah. You don't have it in control. The way of man is not in himself. It's not in himself. It is not in man. It, do you hear what the word said? It's not in man. That walking to direct his steps. To direct his step. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Correct me. That's what the world needs to do. Come on and humble yourself. If my people which are called by my name. Will only humble themselves. Seek his pay. God will have mercy upon you. You need to come and beg God for mercy. My God. So Job couldn't. I mean Balaam couldn't do no more. Than God allow him to do. He said what he say? Must I not take heed? I, yes. can't, I can't go beyond the word of God. Nobody can go beyond the word of God. This is what he said. Read on. Oh Lord correct me. <laughs> yes. But with judgment. With judgment. I'm back in numbers now. My God 22. He couldn't do no more. He said must I not take heed? People can't. God is greater than man saints. You worry and let, you know, they scare you. But God is the boss. Amen. He is the boss. It's not in men that walk it to direct his step. That's Read right. on numbers where you left off. Run mm -hmm. it on down there. Who can count the dust of Jacob? Yes. Or number the four part of Israel? Read on. Let me die the death of the righteous. My God, that's what everybody needs to do. My God, you need to humble yourself under the mighty hands of God. Drop on down to verse 19, yes. 23, 19. God is not a man. People try to play around with God like he's a man, regular man they're dealing with. You're dealing with your maker. You're dealing with the creator. My God, my God. What? Who, who, who? You're dealing with, I want to, sometimes it's good to bring men back. So you can get, you give them some understanding. All you that are out there, rich and poor, high and low. I want you to know who you're dealing with. Amen. Give them Psalms. I believe Psalms 100 and verse, and the third verse. I want you to know who you're dealing with. If people know who they're dealing with, they would have humbled themselves more. Under the mighty hands of God. Psalms 100 and the third verse, I believe. Know ye that the Lord, he is God. Everybody don't know who, who, who God is. No, no. But he said, no, he. Yes. That the Lord. He is God. Who is he? He is God. You play around with him. He oh. can snatch the bread of life out of Nashville. Yes. He is God. Amen. Read on. It is he that made us. All right. You talk strong, you talk bold. Oh, but right, remember, right. you didn't make yourself. Come on, Bishop. Right, Bishop. It is he. It is he that made us. Who made us? It is he that made us. You know, that sometimes you look at people and going on, and if you didn't know better, mm -hmm. you think they're doing it on their own. But if God, if take his spirit oh, yes. and his breath, That's it. is he. That made us. Don't forget who made you. Don't forget your maker. You out there in Raider Land, wherever you are, Amen. you better get busy, do something about your soul. It is He that made us. You didn't make yourself, beloved. It is He that made us. And not we ourselves. All right, what? And not we ourselves. You didn't make yourself. 
You didn't make the way you're acting out there. You're acting like you made yourself. But God can, you know, God can stop man so quick. Amen. Job chapter 34 and verse 14. Mm -hmm. It is he. Yes. You didn't make yourself beloved. Mm -hmm. It is he. Yes, he made us and not we ourselves. Not we ourselves. If he set his heart upon man, Job. If he set his heart, yes, upon man, up on man, if he got unto himself his spirit and his breath, if he got unto himself, and to himself, his spirit and his breath, his spirit, and his breath, and his breath, all flesh shall perish together. Everybody. You see, people need to humble down. Yes, do. Don't forget the one that made you young man. Amen. Young lady, middle age, you going on out, but God can stop you in a second. Oh, yes. All he have to do is get it unto himself. Yes. What? His spirit and his breath. And his breath. All flesh shall perish together. All flesh. You can go down so quick. I'm getting called people go, pray for us. I'm going and have a stroke. This one, brain. Job chapter 12 and 10 now. People need to humble themselves under the mighty hands of God. Listen what the word of God said. In whose hand? In whose hand? Is the soul of every living thing. God got you in his hand. The soul of every living thing. And the breath of all mankind. The breath of how many? All mankind. All right. Oh. My God, you better humble yourself quick. My God, you that are out there in radio life, you know, it's a blessing when you know these things. How Paul said, I know in whom I believe and I'm persuaded. You know, you need to get with somebody that persuaded. Don't get with a double-minded person. No, sir. One minute they say this, the next minute they're doing it. Get on that somebody that persuaded. And when you persuaded, others going to want to be like you. They're going to get persuaded. That's in, I believe that's in 2 Timothy chapter 1 and verse 12. Get with somebody, hang out. Don't hang around with somebody weak. No, sir. They will weaken your faith. Amen. Get with somebody strong. Amen. Get with somebody strong. The righteous and hold on to the way. They that have clean and you can get stronger and stronger over here. You don't have to be weak. Don't let nobody tell you yes, you be. can't be strong in God. Amen. You can get strong in God. Oh, yes. I came in at a young age. Know nothing Amen. about the baptism. But I heard the man of God preach it by way of radio. The late Bishop Randall Goodwin. I came here and I believe God's word. My God, they the word, oh Lord, have I hidden in my heart. You yeah, can, man. young people, you can get strong in God. Don't hang out with anybody. Weak. Listen what Apostle Paul said in this, uh, Second Timothy chapter 1 and I believe verse 12. For which cause I suffer these things. My God, you know, when you when you know in whom you believe, you go through tests Amen. and you say, I won't complain. For which cause I also suffer these things. He suffered, they stoned him, they beat him, yes. they threw him out the city for dead. But he wouldn't let nothing move him. He said, none of these things move me. They stoned him. Yes. They did all kind of things to him. But he said, at which cost I suffer these things. Nevertheless, I am not ashamed. Huh? I'm My not ashamed. God, you're not ashamed. They, they were beating them and they were still giving God the glory. My God, you're not ashamed. Yes. My God, there is one place here, but we are fooled for Christ. For which God? I also Hallelujah. suffer these things. He went before King Agrippa and said, I count myself happy. Yes. What's the matter? For which God? I also suffer these I things. suffer these things. Nevertheless, I'm not ashamed. My God, faith will make you ashamed. Faith will make you come on back yes. and say, I'm willing to go through. I'm willing to go through. 
for which cause I've suffered these things. Yeah, you gotta suffer. You gonna suffer something over here. My God, but I God count the long suffering. I've got counted. I put it on your salvation. My God, for which cause I also. Hallelujah. I suffer these things. Nevertheless. Nevertheless. I'm not ashamed. My God, faith will make you ashamed. You come on back and say, I'm not ashamed. Yes. Nevertheless. I'm not I'm ashamed. Not ashamed. Well, I know whom I believe. What the matter with you, Paul? My God, because I know In whom I, I believe. Know. Not guessing, but he said, I know. God bless Hang you, around here till you know. Yeah. Hang around here till you're sure. Don't get out there. My God, stay here till you say, I know. Yeah. I know. Oh, my heavenly. My God, that's what. No one can stop a child of God. My God, you don't have, you don't have to be a, a hundred, a thousand. You don't have to be 450. The Elijah were going up against Baal prophet. Paul, they were 450 and it was just Elijah alone but Elijah stood and said I only remain a prophet of the Lord but all the rest is false my God he said let's put it to a test my God one day your faith gonna be put to the test but if you go through you're gonna stand the test nevertheless yeah. I suffer Hallelujah! My I'm not God, ashamed. I suffer, but I'm not ashamed. Well, I know you whom I believe. You your suffering, but you say, thank you, Jesus. I count myself happy. Hallelujah! That I'm worthy to suffer shame. I'm thanking God for my suffering. I'm glory in my suffering. Nevertheless, I'm not ashamed. Well, I know. I know. Whom I believe. In whom I believe. And persuaded. My God, you can be persuaded over here. Don't let nobody. I came over here as a little brother. But I hang around here. My God, I hang around here. God at you. the age of 21. But I hang around here. My God, and faith cometh by hearing. And hearing by the word of God. I get God's word within me. Hallelujah. My God, and now I'm not ashamed. Yes. Why? Because I know in whom I have believed. I have believed. And persuaded. That you can be persuaded. And that he's I'd able. Love to, I'd love to get, hang around with somebody persuaded. Hey. I don't love hang around with somebody weak. No, <laughs> you fool with somebody weak, they're going to weaken you. Oh, face. yes, Bishop, that's right. Why? Because evil communication corrupt, corrupt good manners. I, I when I hear somebody weak, I talk in. I do like David did to his brother. He turned from them and turned toward another, talking the right thing. You can't hang around with everybody. They will weaken your faith. My God, I know. Yes. I know whom I believe. Whom I believe. And I'm persuade, persuaded. You can be fully persuaded. That he is able to keep that. He is able to keep that. Saints, God is able. Tell the devil, my God is able. My God is able. He's able. Yes. He is able. To keep that which Hallelujah. I commit unto him. God is able. Just turn it over to Jesus. Turn it over to him. He is able. I don't care how bad the condition look. Look away from the condition and tell the devil, God is able. He is able. My God is able. He is able. To keep that which I, I commit. The church coming out. I tell you the truth, we out already. Faith said we out already. We going through our trouble, going through our test, but we glory in tribulation. tribulation. We're not ashamed. We're not ashamed. Hallelujah. I want the world to know we are not ashamed. We are persuaded. We know in whom we believe. Yeah. And what? Yeah. Commit unto him against that day. Read on. Hold fast. Uh, holy saints. Yeah. Do you hear what the man of God said? Hold it. fast. Hold it. Hold it. Thank God. Somebody gonna hold it. Somebody gonna hold it. 
Somebody going to hold it? Yes. The man of God said, hold fast. Hold fast the form of John word. Somebody going to hold it? Somebody going to hold it? God knows somebody going to hold it. Yes. Somebody going to hold it? Somebody going to hold it? I'm persuaded. Somebody going to hold it? My God, when you believe it, somebody going to hold it. My God, why are you holding it so steadfast that you may be able to give an answer to every that's in fir First Peter, third chapter, verse 15. My God, somebody going to hold it. A young man can hold it. A young woman can hold it. You don't have to wait till you get old. My God, my God. Young man, that written you get strong in God. You can overcome that wicked one. Somebody going to hold it. My God, you don't have to wait till you get old. Amen. One place Paul tell Timothy, let no man despise our youth. Amen. All right, beloved. First Peter, I believe, third chapter and verse 15. But well, sanctify the Lord God in your heart. Come in here. Amen. Don't let the devil make you ashamed. No, Come in sir. here and praise God in a yes. song, in a testimony. Sanctify the Lord God in your heart. And be ready always to give an answer. Tell somebody. Amen. Give an answer to every man. Every man. To ask you of a reason of the hope that is in you. My God, tell him about how good God is. The hope that is in you. With meekness <laughs> and fear. Oh, somebody going to hold this. Beloved, hold it. Oh, Peter wasn't ashamed. Peter held it. Peter in, fur, in John. Uh, 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 St. John 6 and verse 66. So many went away. But Peter was sure. You know you can hang around here till you're sure. You don't need a whole crowd. You don't need a whole crowd. Elijah didn't have a whole crowd. Mm -hmm. Elijah said I only. Remain a prophet of the Lord. And he looked at Baal prophet. 450. He said how long you going to hold. Between two opinions. Yes. If God be God. Serve him. If Baal, then serve him. They said, let's put it to a test. The God that answered our fire. My God saints, you're going to have to put your faith to the test one day. Amen. But it will stand the test. Oh, yeah. My God, they were leaping at the altar. My God, they were hollering, oh Baal, oh Baal. They launched themselves, blood gush out. They have a seal of God, but not according to knowledge. My God, Elijah mocked them. Said, maybe your God that you serve, he's in a journey. Maybe yeah. he's in a chance. Maybe he pursuing. Maybe he sleep. But Elijah know the God that we serve, he don't slumber and he don't sleep. So something wrong with your God. My God, my God. They leap on the altar. But when a man of God know the word of God, he will do like Peter. Listen, Peter, in, in, in St. John chapter 6, verse 66. From that time, many disciples went back. You don't, you won't look at the many. That's right. You look at the one that hole in it. Yeah. My God, I don't look at the many. I'm that people go, man, you hear, I don't care what I hear, what I see, what That's I don't it, see. That's I keep it. my eyes on God. Oh, yes. My God, I'm looking unto Jesus. Man. The altar. And I have people calling me. My God, this month, I was up back in the country, three o'clock in the morning, calling me from Kenya. My God, we want to come on over to the Holy Temple. My God, a young brother called me all the way from Indiana. Friday said, you know, I got out here. I get wrapped up with the wrong crowd. I'm in trouble. I need help. My God, he said, I need help. You know, the devil is the one. Said it, Satan take them captive at his own will. The devil taking people out there captive at his own will. But he cry out. He say, I'm in trouble. I said, son, what you need to do is to save yourself. He said, my rest of family won't come. But I want to come on back. I said, come on back, son. Come on! My God, you better get with God, people. Oh, yes. My God, don't follow the wrong crowd. Yes. All right. Finish me up. Read Run that time. Many of went back. I don't look at the many. Yes. I keep my eye. You know, if, if the devil is a liar, 
people all around. Tell them that it's oh, young sister called me this morning, almost three o'clock in the morning. Bitch, I will hand my knee, go and go with my mother. And then all of a sudden, I, I began to speak some other language than whatever. I said, that's it, God we serve. Somebody gonna get homeless. Yeah. My God, people are crying out. Believe us, more the more added. Somebody out there crying out. The young man came and drove up in the church. Yo, hey, you were in his bed. God wake him out of his sleep. Came and got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Sunday here, here come a sister came in. She got baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Hell, the bastard called me yesterday. Say, man, somebody down here, Bishop. Hey, God come and get baptized. And then they people walking off the street now. The time is getting close now. It's going home time now. All right. From that time, many disciples went back. Many. Don't look at the many. Yes. Look at the one that are contending. Oh, yes. I don't look at the many. Read on. And walk no more with him. Walk no more. Then with said him. Jesus unto the twelve. Unto the twelve. Will you also go away? Will you also go away? Then Simon Peter answered him. Answer him. Lord, to whom shall we go? shall we go thou has the word of eternal life we following you because you got what we need but yes, you word got of the eternal word life. of eternal life and we believe that's what i love you can't stop a believer the road might get rough the hill might get hard to climb but when a man we believe and are sure and I show God that Christ, you are that Christ, the Son of the Living God. You, know, you can be sure about this, man. You don't have to go around knocking around. You can be sure when you're sure, you don't look at nothing else. That's I right. let the world know I'm sure. We are sure. Peter yes. was so sure when he opened his mouth. Close me out. And the day of Pentecost, yes. when he opened his mouth in Acts chapter. Two, verse 36. Therefore, therefore, let all the house of Israel. My God, where is a blessed when you can follow somebody that is sure. Mm -hmm. Let all the house of Israel. Know surely, know surely that God has made that same Jesus. Same Jesus. Whom you have crucified. Crucified. Both Lord and Christ. Both Lord and Christ. Now when they heard this. When they heard this. They were pricked in the heart and said unto Peter. Said unto Peter. And to the rest of the apostles. The rest of the apostles. Men and brethren, what shall we do? What shall we do? Then Peter said unto them. Said unto them. Repent. Repent. And be baptized every one of you. Every one of you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Read on. For the remission of sin. The remission of and sin. ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. My God, they have to do what Peter said. Yes. Because Peter was sure shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. For the promise unto you and to you and to your children. Read on. And to all that are far off. All right. Even as many as the Lord our God shall call. He calling all nations. God. All right, you that are out there in where the land, wherever you are, haven't yet been baptized, you better get busy. Call us up now. Call us up. My God, God tomorrow I promise to any of you. Don't fool around out there and follow in the wrong thing. Get with somebody that is sure. Don't get with somebody one day, one day they're sure, and the next day they're not sure. A double-minded man is unstable in all his way. God bless you. God keep you. We'll be back yes, next week, Lord. It's going the same station, yes, same hour, the same day. You can call Bishop Belgian yes, Green at 718-584-0691 again. You can reach Bishop Belgian Green at 718-584-0691. You may also visit us on the web at www.holytemplechurch.net. Then you can visit yes, us I'm on persuaded. the web at www.holytemplechurch.com. Until then, he is God able. Bless you. Oh, you. Oh, 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 I know. God. You know you can hang around here till you know. Oh yes, hang around here till you're sure. Peter said, we believe and we are sure. You can't do nothing with somebody that is sure. My <laughs> God. But when you're sure, you cause somebody else to be sure. Somebody out there unstable.
as a man the way that man that woman talking it seemed like the shore let's go let i want to go to the church they go to it seemed like the shore my god when the men of gibeon the men of gibeon they heard all all what god was doing for for israel for joshua he told Joshua, this day I'm going to magnify you in the sight of all Israel. They don't heard now. Yeah. They don't heard how Jordan was filled. Jordan was filled up to the brink. It was running over. He said, get the, I want to get 12 men and one out of every tribe. The priest. My God. And let they go on up to Jordan as soon as they feed. The water. My God, it was cut off. Yeah. Oh, Jordan were running over, overflowing the bank. But faith in God, Jordan was driven back. My God, God is a man. Faith in God. They heard how Jordan, they heard how the wall of Jericho fell. No, yes. They heard how the wall of Jericho fell. They heard all what God was doing for them. They heard how AI were defeated. My God, that's it. So when the rest of king coming up against Gibeon, the Gibeonite, they sent to Joshua, said, slack not your hand. Come down quickly. Come help us. Yeah. My God, come deliver us. That all, uh, I believe that's in Joshua, somewhere around 10 and 6. They heard all. You don't think people hearing what's going on among us? Amen. Don't let the fool you now. They hear, my God, they hear souls getting baptized, soul coming in. My God, let me tell you, they are trouble. My God, they are trouble. And all we doing, you're doing what we're doing what Paul charged Timothy. Preach the word. Preach the word. My God, we're not out there fighting or fussing with nobody. We are contending for the faith. You know, you know, when you get, when you have God's word, you don't have to get up fussing and try to tear nobody. Just preach the word. Elijah never had to do all that. Oh, he, Joshua, they heard. And the men again were sent unto Joshua. Sent unto Joshua. To the camp of David. Yes. Saying, slack not thy hand. Don't slack your hand. From thy servant. From thy servant. Huh? Come up. Come, Come up. We need help. That's why I'm telling the people, you out here in Raiderland, wherever you are, you need help. You better call for help. Amen. These men never let they come and destroy them. They cry out for help. Amen. Come up quickly. Save us. Come save us. Help, us. help. You need help, beloved. You that are out there, you don't, don't, don't be not weak in faith. Yeah. Get with somebody strong. Amen. Don't get with some, don't get with the weakest thing out there. Get with somebody strong. Amen. That are contending for the faith. My <laughs> God, you know, my heart rejoice. I walk in and I see Minister Newton. I leave him Sunday. That thing touched my heart. I was praying for him. He's such a faithful man with his walker. But I came back tonight. My God, he walking on his own. That's a faith in God. We don't have, you don't have to, you don't have to go let somebody cut out a, you know, people go, they let somebody cut out a hip bone, cut something. My God, but we, the people of God, that's why a world need to come among us. Among us, which are more surely believe among us. My God, we are contending for the faith. We are holding God. I was telling somebody when I got electrocuted, they tell me, my God, you won't be able to use your hand. My God, say all the dish, all the fire, everything burn up. My God, you won't have no strength in it no more. My God, but I thank God for being a nice strong leader. Oh, strong yes, leader man. makes strong people. Thank God for Bishop Randolph Goodwin. He said, you know the doctrine, son. Just let the rip my flesh was rip apart. Let it cut it off. My God, he said, you know what I'm preaching you. 
My God, I went there. They tell me you're going to die. Your gonna, body going to go in the shot. You're going to collapse. My God, no medicine, no painkiller. The first nurse saw me coming. She took off and run. She said, this is too much for me. But I will hold in God. I will continue tending for the faith that was once delivered to the saints. My God, when I walk in, I tell God I, I was I was burning from my head to my to my toe. I said, Lord, you got the power to quench a fire, a fire going through this body. But my God, they tell me we're gonna have to do this. We're gonna have to. Go. My God, they want me to make. I never spent a night in the hospital. I just went there and let that clean it up and cut and clean up, cut it, uh, move the dead skin. No medicine, no painkiller. Faith in God. The late minister James Weber, he said, Oh, it's hurt when it's seen. Even the doctor, then it's hurt. But our hole in heaven, my Amen. God, faith has preached to me, and I will hold in faith. Lord, if you don't heal me, who else gonna heal me? Don't let me go down before the unbeliever when it seemed like there was a time when I looked like I was gonna part, but God strengthened me. My God says God is a healer. He's a deliverer. Amen. The word of God said that you earnestly contend for the faith. Get with somebody strong. Don't follow everything. Everybody not holding the faith. No, not. Do you hear what the word of God said? Everybody not holding it. Man. They talk big, they talk strong, but they're not holding it. Lord, what do you say, Paul? They profess that they know God. They know God. Yes. But in what? I am. Then people get mad. Why you all can't get together? Mm -hmm. I just let them know plain. Mm -hmm. It's very simple. Can two walk together? Except that they agree. Except they agree. And Apostle Paul said, have no fellowship with the unfruitful workers of darkness. Yes. But rather, we going on. We going on to perfection. You still hanging around Acts 2.38. You still hanging, but we gone on to perfection. We gone on to faith in God. We gone on. You still hang around. You still hang around taking medicine and all these things. But the we the people of God. Paul said that I might know him and the power of his resurrection. My God, we're going on to perfection. My God, the church is going on. My God, people get mad at us. But we are contending for the faith. If any sick among us, yeah. let him call. Oh, Hallelujah. Church. We are contending for the faith. Amen. For the elders of the church, let them pray over him. And nine to the Lord, in the name of the Lord, the prior of faith shall save the sick. The Lord shall raise him up. I'm giving you my own testimony. They tell me I'm going to collapse. My body going to go in the shock. My God, but I hold on to God. My God, my God. I wait on God. I went there so they could give me my letter for my job. I was working with the state then. My God, and I have to produce a letter for my sick leave. So I went and they said, oh, we got to do this. Send it to a burn, oh, no burn center. I wait on God. I wait on God. The man of God, Bishop Goody Gay, the late minister James Weber, three scripture to go read to me. My God, hey, he read it. One of the one was the same one that I was I I telling God, you got power to quench the fire, fire going through this body. But oh, he came, Weber came and he shook his head. He said, Papa, I know you heard it. Hey. My God, a voice hurt my ear. But I, I was contending for the faith. I held God through it all. Through it all. Through it all. When the enemy said you're going to collapse, I held on to faith in God. 
My God, Bishop Gooden says, son, you know I love you. I don't pray. And God tell, I tell, God tell me, don't go. I have, I have them packing my things together to come to pray for you. But she said, God tell him, don't go. I'm going to send my angel. My angel is stronger than you. Oh, they can yes. do more than you can. Amen. He said, son, I'm waiting oh, on the Bishop. angel. My oh, God, there you. was a time I remember that last Wednesday night. I had a preach and I turned to the late minister James Weber. I gave him the key. I said, here is the key. He said, what's that? I said, here is the key. Carry on. I ain't coming back in here no more like this. I said, I'm burning. I'm hurting. I could only preach with one hand in the air. My God, but I was contending for the faith. I gave him the key and said, I'm going home. When they come, they're going to see a, a dead body in the bed. My God say, I stretch out as far as I could stretch. My God, the, the good and say, the ain't my son saw me rolling. Man, the blue before Wendy, he called Bishop Goodwin. He said, son, son. I said, I'm hurting. I'm hurting. He said, I'm praying. I'm praying. I'm holding God. He said, you're going to send the angel. I'm looking for God to do it. Hmm. My God. God. Lord, I lay in my bed. I said, by the time those angels come, I'm gone. Yeah, yeah. It's going to be a dead body. You know, you got to be. A, it's going to be a dead body in the bed tonight. I don't give up to die. So say, God will take you to your limit. To your wit end. When I gave over to die. My God. God, then here come. I'm in the bed. Stretch out. Waiting. Any minute now. The bread of life. I'm going to make my peace. Knowing there was nothing between my soul and my Savior. Yes, so I was ready to go. Yes. My God. Then here I'm dead. I hear somebody walking like a man. Walking to my room. My God, say, I'm there with my hand there on the head turned to the right. All of a sudden, see like somebody went around my bed, feel my hand going up and down. Oh, Both five or six times around, I put it back by my side. Then I look. I said, what's going on here? See like the pain done gone. Then I look over to the right, to the bedside. I don't see nobody. I look underneath the bed. I don't see nobody. I went with my hand that they tell me I wouldn't be able to use like this. I went and when I went and when I look in the mirror, I look in the mirror in the bathroom, my hand popped wide open like this. Amen. Don't tell me. God. You think I'm going to fool with men? You think I'm going to let men weaken my faith? Bishop Green was my witness. I called him that thing. I said, Bishop Green, I'm healed. I got the victory. I'm healed. God is a healer, say. God is a deliverer. Yes, he my son, I never I thought my son, you know, I feel so sorry for him. He was about 13, 14 then. And he was so scared. I said, Lord, I'm going to leave this boy. But he was there so pitiful. The next month, he know, he run up. He said, Daddy, what, I heard somebody walk up the staircase. Was it you were walking? I heard the walk and open the door and come in your room. I said, who, 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 who was it? I tell him what happened. He said, I start to come up, but I'm glad I didn't come up there. I tell, I tell, I tell, him, what I, I tell him what happened to my hand. He said, I'm glad I didn't come. He says, God is a healer. God is a healer. Just hold God's word. You hold God's word, sir. Saints, you will come out. Hold God's word. How, how can I link up with somebody weak now? That's right. I don't, after all that I've been through. That's right, Bishop. And I'm going to link up with somebody. No, He's going to tell me ghost. No. No, sir. No. Mm -mm. God bless you. What did he say? What did I say? What were you at? Gibeon? Yeah. And the men of Gibeon sent unto Joshua. That's what you all out there need to do. Call for somebody contending yes. for the faith. Don't get with somebody. Yeah. 
stone and a tinking cymbal, making a lot of noise. Get with somebody that holy, you know. Elijah was making all that lot of noise and, and leap and out and hear me now. Elijah said, Lord, hear me now. I've done it according to the how forcible a right word. Elijah never had to cut himself and it was just him alone. Hear me now. I've done it according to the word. My God, the fire fell. Then you hold God's word. Listen, somebody going to take note? What happened? The men of Gibeon. The men of Gibeon sent to Joshua to the camp of Gilead. You say, that are out there, the get with some, say, call for somebody that are contending for the faith. Amen. That's what you all need to do now. Say, Bishop. Slack not thy hand. Slack not the hand from my servant. Come, Come up. Read on. Come up to us quickly. We and need help. Come up quick. And yeah. save us. We need help. We need to be delivered. Yes. You that are out there, you need to call us up. Amen. Come help us. Save us. And help no, us. Help us. You need help, beloved. Don't hang around something weak. Be not weak in faith. You're not growing. You're not growing. Amen. You got to grow up in God. Read on. Help us. Help us. For all the kings of the Amorites. Read on. That dwell in the mountain are gathered together against us. Everything got up against us. Read on. So Joshua ascended from Gilead. My God. You got the Joshua have some experience with God. He done, he done, he done watch Jericho, the wall of Jericho fell. Yeah, he watched Jordan was driven back. My God, brother, my God.